Welcome to day two of Mermaid. I felt like drawing and uploading something today, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, I made the sketch beforehand. And, yeah. It's been a very wet and tired, tiring day had some of my finals and I felt like drawing not a mermaid today but still a fin folk or fish person 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 this here is uh, still within my setting of music box this is someone who is a hybrid of different creatures. This person specifically, no idea who they're supposed to be. They're just a doodle. Are a hybrid between a mermaid and a human. In music box, different creatures are able to have children with other different creatures, uh, regardless of some genetic stuff. And it's a bit more complicated than that, but it is possible. One of the kind of common hybrids are actually people who are a mix of sea folk and of humans. For one thing, and the reason they're so common is that humans and fish folk tend to come in contact a lot. And when they do come in contact, they aren't extremely different. Okay, they're quite a bit different, but aesthetically, they are similar enough to each other where people will not really bat an eye out about it. Some people do, but not everyone. One common such thing, uh, is the resulting, well, <sighs> the hybrids that are result are quite common. They don't have any particular name. Some, in some regions they do. Most regions where they occur, they don't. Oh, no, now that I think about it, it wouldn't make sense that they don't have, that it isn't common. Or, <laughs> can I speak today? No, never. I can never speak properly. Proper English. English. Who is she? I do not know. Um, regardless. The... They pr different regions it makes more sense that they would have specific names for the hybrids between humans and the alluring mermaids. Um, what those names are, I'm not quite certain. I'll have to think about that more. I don't know. There's many possibilities. There's been a lot of different merfolk mythologies throughout the years. But in hybrids, when it comes to hybrids in music box, it's complicated, but it's also much more simple. Many creatures who are sentient can have hybrid with each other, either through normal means or through magical means. Uh, these hybrids have a wide variety of appearances and forms that they can take. 
This often depends on the parents and how compatible the two species are. For example, two species uh, that are of, uh, okay, I should probably explain that first. So there's a thing called kins in Music Box. And the kins are like large categories of related creatures. I will explain them at some point, but not today. Um, basically the only important thing to note for hybrids is that the closer two kins are to each other, the more likely the hybrid is to be successful and not have a bunch of issues. Two kins that are further away from each other, with some exceptions, tend to have a decently large amount of physical or mental or other issues. Not always, but it's more common. Um, and there are also exceptions when it comes to kins that are close to each other, especially if creatures have two different body plans, such as centaurs and humans. Um, other times, when they have two different body plans, it results in creatures like this. And sea kin, which is what the fin folk and the mermaids are from, are quite close to human kin, which is where humans and elves and a few other creatures are among. So yeah, that was rambling, but that was a picture for today.